Driving on the fucking highway is funny as shit. I mean, like, everyone just loves to hug the left side of the road. I understand that's supposed to be the fast side, but, like, is it really the fast side anymore? I feel like everyone just goes over there and is like, like, oh, yeah, like, I'm on that side. I'm good. But it's like, today, weirdly enough, almost a fucking whole mile of everyone on the left side. The right side completely fucking cleared. Like, I was, like, kind of dumbfounded by, like, how ridiculous that is. Like, what the fuck? Like, why... Like, why would you, like... Everyone just, like, on the left side. I mean, right now, I'm on the left side driving right now. But, you know, I'm... There's, like, not that many people, like, on the right side for me to, like, really get over. I was almost thinking about it because there's, like, a FedEx truck, but I, I don't know. Sometimes I like being behind those big tractor trailer trucks because, like, I don't know, that they obviously have to use their, like, hydraulic brakes, air brakes or whatever, and that's takes more out of their shit than me slamming on my fucking brakes all the fucking time on the highway. Like, uh, constantly, like, especially being on the left side, everyone, like, loves to just, like, basically, like, fuck each other on the fucking left side, and they're, like, right up each other's assholes, like smelling each other basically like smelling what they fucking ate that morning or whatever the fuck like I don't even understand all that but yeah I mean like shit like I I don't understand like the concept of like everyone getting on the left side it's like it's not the fucking fast side anymore and then like there's dickheads that keep inching up like as if like they're gonna get fucking anywhere closer Like, I can understand, like, you know, a huge fucking gap difference. Like, I just fucking overtook. Like, there was literally no one for, like, a mile in the right lane. So, like, I was like, all right, yeah, sure. Let's fucking go. I'll easily take that opportunity. But it's like, when there's traffic and it's like, you have, like, the tiniest gap, everyone always has to be like, oh, no, wait. This guy is being slacker. Like, he left, like, a semi-gap. Enough that I can maybe start putting my turn signal at the last second and then just, like, whisk my way fucking inside because, like, that's how fucking everyone drives. Turn signal at the last fucking second. When, like, that's not how a fucking turn signal is operated, you fucking retard. Like, the turn signal is supposed to be a precautionary signal letting people know what the hell you're about to do well before you even do it. So to do it, at the same time as you fucking, like, making the maneuver, that doesn't mean, that, like, doesn't count. It's like, you might as well not even fucking used it. It's like, we already knew that, like, we could obviously tell that you're getting over it because the fucking vehicle is physically moving the fuck over. But, like, I don't know, like, it's, it's baffling that, like, people every day feel like they are in more of a rush than everyone else. Like, that people are like, no, like, I need to get where I'm going faster. Like, fuck you. Fuck your day. Fuck everyone's shit. Like, there's no driving etiquette anymore. Like, everyone's just like, oh, no, let's, like, be fucking assholes and just, like, drive, like, reckless fucking idiots all the fucking time. Like, I don't understand that. Like, I don't know. I mean, like, I'm driving, like, I usually drive pretty fucking well, like, oriented or whatever. You know, like, I'm pretty, like, well managed when I drive. Yeah, I get, like, my road rage, but that's because of fucking all these other idiots. It's not like I'm just driving around being like, nah, fuck this, and, like, zipping around fucking left and right, like, (coughs) weaving between people because of, like, whatever reason. Like, right here. Right now, a vehicle, there's, like, literally no one going anywhere, but this car's like, nah, I need to get in the left lane because that's the faster lane, and we're literally not moving any faster than when he first... Then when he fucking inched his way in. Like, we're literally in the same fucking position. Nobody is going anywhere. We're all driving at the same fucking dumb, like, monotone 55 fucking whatever miles per hour. Like, it's like everyone's going the same fucking speed limit right now. There is no fast lane. There is no such thing as the fast lane anymore. I know that that was, like, a popular song, Life in the Fast Lane, blah, blah, blah. But, like, nah. There is no fast lane. All lanes are the lanes now. There is no, like, all right, you get on the left lane to, like, 
you know, because you're in a fucking more of a hurry than all the other assholes. It's like, no, nah, like, because the other assholes now get in the left lane. Be like, oh, I'm going to comfort drive in this lane. And that is what's fucking everything up for you fucking retards that, like, can't understand or comprehend the concept of fucking driving. It's like you all want it in, like, some fucking bulk lottery that, like, or, like, participation medals type of shit. Like, they were just giving it away to fucking everybody. I mean, that's essentially what they do with a license. Like, I feel like when I got it, I was, like, it was laughable how easy the fucking test was that I passed the fucking, like, whatever, not written because it's, like, on the computer and they, like, answer fucking little dumb picture questions and shit. I passed that first time. And then the driving test, I fucking passed that, like, fucking easy as fuck. And then it's, like, baffling when I hear people being like, oh, yeah, I failed, like, the driving part. It's like, really? Like, did the, like, instructor actually make you do more things? Because, like, I didn't have to do shit, it seemed. Like, all I had to do was, like, drive, you know, flip my fucking signals once in a while. I would go in a circle, essentially, and then, like, parallel park. And... It was the easiest fucking thing ever. Like, I feel like it's, like... I don't know. I mean, like, I guess, like, a lot of people get their license when they're 16 or 15 and a half. Whatever, like, stupid rule that works with. But, like, I got it, I guess, when I was 18 or whatever. But, like... I mean, I always... I knew how to drive. I drove anyway without a license. Yeah. So what? I mean, a lot of people do that. A lot of people go in bars, like, before they're 21. Like, the fuck is the difference? Like, as long as I'm not, like, a fucking reckless 16-year-old faggot, like, you know, like, I didn't drive around like a fucking asshole, even when I, uh, yeah, let's get in the middle lane. (coughs) But, like, even when I, like, wasn't, like, you know, I don't know, shit's fucking retarded anyway, but fuck it. Like, getting off topic, like, the fucking... It's mainly all about just driving on the fucking highway. Please, people, please. Can you please? I don't know. Is there YouTube videos on how to drive? Like, can people watch that maybe? And that might help the fucking dumbass society that are, like, stuck to their fucking screens. That, like, they can't, like, not be on the fucking phone for more than, like... Like, they... Like, if they're off off screen for five minutes it's like the end of the fucking world for people it seems and like I don't understand that like I I I go on my phone yeah sure I mean I spend more time listening to music on my fucking phone like I don't talk to anybody and no I don't really even talk to people in general I think I am like very awkward of a human we'll say and I am like anti-social but like I sometimes seem not antisocial, but I am super antisocial. I am introvert as fuck. I would rather spend almost every single day sitting on my couch in front of my TV with weed and my PlayStation, and I'm good. I don't need to go out. I don't need to, like, see people say hello. I mean, I, I actually do. I'm lying. I like going out and seeing people saying hello, you know conversating with people I haven't seen in, like, a month or so and shit, like, you know, especially with me having a baby soon, like, (coughs) a little future, uh, you know, Xena, my daughter, Xena Rose, she's gonna be absolutely fucking beautiful, I can't wait, uh, all these motherfuckers are gonna be jealous, cause I'm gonna have the most absolute beautiful and perfect child, arguably, I mean, like, I'm curious if... I'm assuming she's gonna get the blonde hair in this mix. Because I heard usually by science standards, like, you know, it's like, uh... The baby... Like, the child usually takes on, like, the hereditary of, like, the mother's side for the hair or whatever. So, like, I'm guessing I'm gonna be, like... Hopefully she has blue eyes. I, I have the biggest assumption that she's gonna have blue eyes so she's gonna have gorgeous fucking blue eyes and then as well as blue eyes I kind of hope she gets black hair but if not that's cool not too much of a worry she'll have gorgeous blonde hair and it'll be awesome anyway like 
I'm the most terrified I've ever been in my entire life and excited, ugh, excited as fuck. Sorry, I'm burping or something. A little couple bites of a breakfast sandwich so far on my way in. Gonna finish it when I park up since I clearly got to work a lot sooner than I thought. Traffic was like super, super not bad today. Very mild, uh, compared to, like, the rest of the fucking week. I don't understand how, like, it's, like, Monday, Monday and Tuesday are always the worst days to drive. It's, like, everyone doesn't want to be on the road because it's the beginning of the week, I get it. And, like, you know, you're, like, eh, like, I just, like, partied, I, like, had, like, five dudes fuck me over the weekend because I'm a stupid fucking horse slut or whatever your situation is. I'm assuming that's what, like, most females go through on their weekends because it seems like girls, I don't know, I'm being sexist, maybe a little bit. Girls aren't that slutty. I know plenty of girls that, like, are the most, like, prude motherfuckers on the planet, and it's like, uh, okay, like, like my, uh, yeah, I I don't want to be name-dropping, but yeah, I have, like, friends that definitely... Alright, here I gotta, like, slow down because the fucking idiots like to drive like fucking retards here. I almost got in two accidents in the past, both Monday and Tuesday. Like how I was saying, for some reason, Monday and Tuesday are the worst days, I guess, because it's, like I said, beginning of the week. People don't like to go to work. I get it. I fucking hate and despise going to work. I hate the fact that there's those dumb fucking YouTubers... That they just play fucking video games. And they suck at the video game for one. Most of them aren't even good at the video game. Like I don't know what like really makes or drives them to like get views. It's like clearly all these fucking like dumb faggot fucking kids. That are like oh they're playing Minecraft. They're playing Fortnite. Like yeah like they're playing the fucking gayest games ever. Like those games are fucking lame as shit. Like, PUBG is way better than Fortnite, and I feel like the community for that should get bigger. I mean, I might even jump back on that just for the hell of it. Just because I despise Fortnite. Fortnite sucks. Like, gay as fucking game. Like, that game is complete trash. The only maybe cool thing about it is that, like, oh yeah, they had, like, the ability because they have all those micro uh, transactions from all those fucking dumb kids... That had their parents pay, like, thousands of fucking dollars for, like, dumb weapons and skins. But now they can afford to, like, put, like, you know, big name fucking characters and shit. Like, when they first came out, they were, like, you know, bebopping with these, like, dumb made-up characters that looked, like, gay as fuck. Like, some, like, astro fucking punk. But, like, cotton candy looking motherfuckers. I don't know. Like, shit is just fucking dumb with that. I don't know, like... All I know is that, like, uh, people just need to drive better. That's all. uh, Let's get back on topic. The people just need to drive better. The fact that people don't know how to fucking drive is the most asinine shit ever. Like, I don't understand why nobody knows how to drive. Like, is it something in the water? I could believe that. But probably not. All I know is that people just suck at driving and they just need to get better. I don't know. I don't know how to do that. Like I said, there should be a YouTube video. YouTube video that shows people how to fucking drive. And I guarantee people would fucking watch it because people are addicted to their fucking screen. Or a TikTok video. Make a 10-part whatever gay TikTok video about how to drive. Especially on the highway. If somebody does that and people learn from it, I would appreciate it. And I would almost praise TikTok or YouTube for, you know, teaching retards how to fucking drive. Because, like, it seems like everyone needs to know how to drive better. I feel like I'm a terrible driver, but I managed to fucking get to A and B without hitting anybody. Without causing issues. And or anything like that. I got in, like, two accidents in my fucking life, basically. Three. (laughs) Three accidents. Most of them... Two of them were because of my truck, basically. I had a shitty truck. Actually, they were all because of my truck. 
But two were because my truck's brakes were very shitty. They would grind over and I wouldn't be able to brake properly. And then the other accident is because... Uh, oh, no, the fucking... Those tractor-trailer drivers, they just, like, are annoying. Like, if you're not going to drive fast in the left lane, that's the point. I, like how I was saying earlier, it's supposed to be the fast lane. It's not the fast lane anymore. It's just a lane for people to take up space now. People just like to go in there and take up the space... And not do anything. They just love to be in the way. People love to cause conflict and issues. Like, I don't know why. It's like because they're so fucking miserable and there's dumb everyday life. It's like, yeah, I'm miserable too. But like, I don't go out and do petty fucking dumb faggot shit like that to like make myself feel better. Because it's not going to make me feel better. It's going to make me feel, if anything, more of a piece of shit about myself. Because I have to go out and do these petty things to make myself feel better. Like, that's pathetic. Worst logic ever. If you're anything like that, then I feel sorry for you and you should fucking burn in hell. Hell doesn't exist anyway, so you should drift off in the void or whatever. Forever. Like, in complete blackness and then your mind will just go insane. Uh, That might be better than hell. Hell, it's like you're just tortured, blah, blah, blah. That's like, whatever. I feel like arguably being stuck in an endless void of blackness full blackness like you can't see anything around you like all everything is just black i feel like you would go insane and that would be more fucked up for eternity yeah i don't know fuck you fuck everything fuck all these fucking faggots on the road i can't stand it i wish all these fucking assholes would die i don't know that's a good rant i got like a you know almost like 17 minutes up on this bitch That's a pretty impressive rant. And that's it for the morning. Here we go.